Just went live on TikTok and YouTube at the same time. Love to use every mobile device I have at once. So tonight I am making Air an Air Jordan, a giant high top sneaker out of balloons because one of my clients wants me to make it. And honestly, I have no idea how to do it. None whatsoever. So I need some practice. Um, I gotta make this Air Jordan and um I gotta see if it's gonna turn out okay. So we're gonna, we're gonna, it's gonna be a journey tonight, folks. It's gonna be a journey. We're gonna see how it's going. All right, so let's see. Everybody who's showing up in, uh, in, in TikTok and YouTube, what's going on? Denise, hey, how you doing? Good to see you again. I'm making an Air Jordan out of balloons because I have a client who wants one and I have no idea what I'm doing. She wants it really crazy detailed. No clue what I'm doing. I'm going to, I'm literally going to troubleshoot it through on the live here tonight, right? If I'm going to have to practice, I might as well do it live. What's going on everybody in TikTok world? Hey, Cinnamon, Cinnamon Rolly. I'm just going to say Cinnamon. That's a long, that's a long name right there. Okay. Should I continue? Siri, listen to Siri jumping in. No, no, Siri. I don't care what you have to say. We'll mute that. Sorry, I got interrupted by Siri. That's crazy, man. Okay. What's up, everybody in TikTok world? Kenneth, Kenneth F2021. There's your shout out. Everybody, Kenneth showed up in TikTok. He's saying hello. He's saying hello. Say hi back. Denise, I hope you're right. I hope you're right. But here's the thing. She wants it in red and black, okay? And I don't have the red balloons that I want to use to practice. So I'm going to have you guys help me out, Okay. What color should I use instead of the red? Just for the practice. When I make it for the client, I'll get the red balloons. But right now, I don't have enough red to do it. So, should we do purple, dark blue, green, or orange? What do we got? Orange, dark blue, uh, green, dark blue. Or dark purple? What do you think? Still waiting on right tangle. You're going to have to wait, brother. Green. I got one for green. Can I have a shout out? Kenneth, I, I shouted you out, homie. Okay. Green? Green? All right. That's lit. I, I could wait all night and I could take... What's going on, EPG plays? Purple or orange? So everybody's... It's all over the board. I think I should just pick one. Honestly, I think everybody could kind of be... What one will show up nice in this light? Let's, let's just do that. What one will show up nice here? Purple might be too dark against my shirt, so purple and blue are out. Green, green's too dark against my shirt. There you go. The orange will show up nice against my shirt. Boom, orange, done. Okay. So excuse me, everybody. Let me go get the orange balloons I need here. I shall return. Okay. Had to get another thing of orange. All right, peeps. Now, I'm not exactly sure where to start with this thing, okay? No clue. All I know is this is what I have to make. <laughs> so to make it well, I think I'm going to have to build it in like layers, right? So I think the white feels like it's going to be inside and, and this like this red here feels like it's going to be like an inside layer. And then these stripes and these things here are going to feel like they're going to be on the outside. So I'm going to try to build outwards from the middle, if that makes any sense. I don't quite know. I don't know if it makes sense. I'm gonna try it though. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna try it. All right, so let's see what I got. What's up everybody in TikTok? Thanks for hanging out. What's up everybody in YouTube? Thanks for hanging out. All right, so I think I'm gonna start with the sole first. If I start up here, I think it'll be a mess. So I think I'm gonna start down here and build up. So if you see, there's a little rim of red on the bottom. So I think I'm gonna start with some red and I think I'm gonna wrap a white one around the edges. Might might look terrible. I might not. I don't. I don't know how this is gonna go. I don't know how this is gonna go, man. This is this is gonna it's gonna be interesting. This is gonna be interesting. So let's see. Let's get some orange ones first. It would help to know where my cameras are. I keep looking over here, but my cameras are here and here and here and here. What's up? Okay. Okay. Let's blow some of these oranges up first, and then we'll go from there. I don't, I'm not exactly sure. I'm not exactly sure. I have an idea of what I want to do, but I don't know exactly what I want to do. MP, what's up? What, uh, what is it? If not, just make a big German flag. I'm fine with that. Okay, well, it's not happening tonight. I can tell you that. 
it's a work night for me, guys, so I can't be up too late. Um, I want to try to make this, uh, this, this sneaker because my client's been asking for it forever. Um, and I can't, I can't, I can't leave her hanging until like a week before the event. I have to try to get this done first. So here's what I'm doing. I'm going to try to make a, uh, I'm going to try to make a version of this sneaker, like a mock-up version of this sneaker and go from there. Whew. Okay. So let's see if this is going to work. Um, I don't know, man. I don't know. No, you know what? No, I don't like that. I'm going to use the bigger ones. See, already, already I'm changing my mind. Pass out. I'm going to pass out. All right. All right, so instead of the red, we're doing orange, just because that's what I have available to me. Ooh, okay. I'm periodically going to check in and say hi to everybody. Where's your friend? Uh, Cinnamon, um, my boy Eric is at his house. Uh, I asked him the other day if he wanted to jump on the live with me when I was working on the sneaker, and he told me absolutely not. I'm going to stay home and play video games. So Eric is chilling tonight at his house. This is my house, so it's all good. <coughs> so I think what I'm going to do, this is my idea, just so you guys are following along what I'm doing here. So I'm going to start at the heel of the sneaker. Uh, on the bottom, right? So right now, you see how there's just a little strip of red on the bottom? I'm making this orange, which is the red, and I'm going to make just the heel section, and I'm going to I'm going to basically make the whole bottom first out of the orange, and then I'm going to take a white one and wrap it around the outside, and hopefully, hopefully, it'll make it look right. But we'll see. That's that's what I'm doing right now. Yep. Okay. But I got to make this thing big. I have to make this thing probably like three feet long. Eh. So wait, oh, you know what? <whistles> Measuring tape. I'll just keep this out just for reference, right? I'll just keep that chilling. Chilling. You guys can't see it, but it's there. So, okay, let's see. Let's make this feel pretty big. Let's make this feel pretty big. All right. Yeah. Yeah. And so this is the heel section on the bottom, right? And then I have to make the middle section. The, where the white is basically. So I'm gonna have that there. So I'll make that, make that little section just, I guess maybe a little longer than the heel. Just a little, but not by a lot. Not by a lot, just by a little. Not by a lot, just by a little. Am I standing too close to the camera? I don't even know, man. Okay, who's talking here? What great idea, Denise. I didn't see uh, I didn't see what you said, Denise. What'd you say? Why can't I see my uh, chats here? There we go. Oh, great idea. Oh, okay. Weave. I could weave. I could weave, but I feel like um, I thought about it. I thought about weaving, but I don't know that it's going to give me the uh, aesthetic that I necessarily want. And if this ends up looking like terrible, then I might end up falling back on weaving, but we'll see. Hang on. <laughs> Making me nervous. Can you make the noise from Pizza Tower next? I don't even know what that is. I gotta look that up. We'll see, we'll see though. We'll see. Okay, let's see how long this is. So this is only, this is only slightly over two feet long. Maybe I gotta make it even bigger. Measuring tape, I got the measuring tape. All right, but we're just gonna, this is only a mock-up anyway, so it doesn't have to be absolutely perfect. But we'll try it. Now, I've been thinking about this, I've been thinking about this all day, like how I want to do this, where I want to go with this, all that kind of stuff, and I have no clue. I have no clue. Hi, I don't know you, but hi. What's up, Sonny? I don't know you either, but that's cool. Now we know each other. I'm Jason. I'm a balloon guy. All right, all right, let's see. All right, so I want to make... I want to make this thing relatively big. These might be too big, but let's let's just see. There's a lot of air in these. Should have went with a light green. Oh, everybody's a critic. All right, well it's okay. This is just a mock up anyway, though. So you know the the real deal is going to be red. This is just practice. This one might be too big. 
You look very underrated and sweet. Well, thank you very much. I feel like I'm underrated. <laughs> I feel like I'm underrated in general. But, you know, okay, so let's see. So this is going to be the heel section, and I'm going to make this a loop. I'm going to make it the right size. Da, 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 da. Okay, that'll work, that'll work. So I'm going to take a white balloon, and I'm going to run it around the edges to be like the bottom of this Nike Air thing. But when I put it out, it's going to bump outwards. I don't want the end of the sole popping out past here. It's got to kind of line up. So this thing, which is going to be the, the sneaker part, is going to have to pop out a little bit past that. So I know you guys don't know what I'm talking about. So let me just show you. Let me just show you. So this. Let me see here. Uh, I hate staring down. I want to be looking at you guys, but it's hard when I'm trying to see what I'm doing here. See, that's, see how it pops out past it like that? That's a little too much. Let me make it a little smaller. Just a little bit. Got it. Still a little too big. Come on. Come on, balloons. This is like, I'm getting mad that it's not like an exact science or whatever. A little smaller again. A little smaller again. All right, this is it. I'm just leaving it like this. Crap. Oh, I should have put Do Not Disturb on my phone. I'm getting neighborhood alerts about a lost dog in my neighborhood. That's too small now. Come on, you guys. I need your support. I need your backup. This is it. This is how I'm leaving it no matter what. Okay. This, I guess. I don't know. Okay. Let the extra air out. And I gotta tie these two up so we don't lose any air. Mm -hmm. okay. This thing. Now I need a little guy. Oh, wait a minute. I had a little guy. I don't want to be wasteful, right? I blew these up earlier. Okay. Now, if I were to make this for a client, I would have everything absolutely perfect. But because it's a mock-up, I'm going to have little sloppy things like this little nub. This balloon is going to be sticking out. Sticking out the bottom like that. See that little, uh, that little nozzle sticking out like that? That's really sloppy as far as I'm concerned. But normally I wouldn't leave it out. But because this is just practice, no big deal. Okay. Now, I have to use this as an attachment point for this. And I'm just going to make sure it's the right height. You know, sometimes you think to myself, like, you know, some of these things I'm doing are not made for lives. <laughs> this might be one of them. Okay, so there is the heel of the sneaker right there. That's where we're going with this. Like that. As for the rest of it, I don't know. I'm totally, I'm totally whatever. He's making an Air Jordan sneaker. Thanks, MP. Thanks for letting everybody know what's up. What are you making? TikTok, Squishmallows, pets, whatever. I'm making an Air Jordan sneaker. I have a client of mine locally who wants me to make one of those, a big one, out of balloons. And uh, that's what I'm doing. So we'll see. This is just practice because I've never made it before. This isn't the one that I'm giving the client. I'm just kind of, uh, I'm just kind of working through it. No, 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 Gotta have your materials ready. If you're gonna be on camera, come on, man. All right, these proportions might be way off. All right, let's see. All right, now this is gonna be the middle part of the sneaker at the bottom. Not with that one though. Come on. Come on now. Come on now. Okay. Where was I? Where was I? Alright. 
tuck this in. So it's a real interesting thing to do. Uh, well, thank you for the compliments, Sonny, but let's hold off on the compliments, right? It, this thing might end up terrible. <laughs> if it's terrible, it doesn't matter how interesting it is, but I, I appreciate your support. I really, really do. Thank you. So check it. So this thing is gonna be another, uh, another place to, to, to attach, right? So, I just attached the middle thing. I know it looks like total garbage right now, but hopefully, hopefully it'll shape up into something cool. <clears throat> okay. Don't use your teeth at home, everybody. Bad habit, bad habit. Okay. So, you see I got... This middle part, this part, which is just a total mess. You know what? Hold tight. Hold tight. Hold on a minute. There we go. There we go. Sometimes you just got to get rid of this extra stuff. There we go. There we go. Who said what? Who said that? Who said that? Balloons being bad and popping. Yeah, we don't like that. We don't like that. Shoes in the back. Bow. That's what I'm doing. All right, so got that part. This is the first layer, the middle part. And now I'm going to do the, uh, the front. So I'm going to do another orange, okay? I know you have vision when the plan comes together. I hope it comes together, man. <laughs> I really do, Denise. I hope it comes together. Blowing up these huge balloons ain't easy, all right? It's going to make me pass out. I'm going to watch anime, but good luck and hope your client likes your balloon. Hey, I hope so too. Hey, when this when this whole live is done, uh, the live posted a channel. So if you guys don't want to hang out for the whole thing, I mean, it would be cool if you did. But if you don't and you want to see the finished product, um, the live will be on the channel later on. So check it out. Mm. All right, so let's see. So I have to make sure this is the same, the right size. Right about there should do it. That'll work. Right, so let's see here. Hey, do you love fishes? <laughs> fish, fish are cool. I like, I like fish. I'm a big fan of sushi. Who like it? I'm a big fan of sushi. Dude, yellowtail, tuna, all day, son, all day. What's going on? What's going on, my people? I stand you now. I have no idea what that means. Forgive me. Forgive me. I'm lost. Okay. All right. So, take this big loopy thing I made and attach it in here. Okay. There's my first layer of the sneaker. Of that. I know it doesn't look of that. I know it doesn't look like anything. Oh, wait, no, it was that way. Uh -huh. But we'll see. Listen, this is what practice is for, man. Sometimes you totally blow it and sometimes it's cool, but you know, whatever. Oh, you understand me now, got me. Got it, got it, got it, my bad. Okay, now, let me, what do I wanna add, what do I wanna add? I think I want to add the white, what do you call it? I think I want to add the white around the sole. This white around the sole. Let's see if this is bigger. This might be too big. I might have to get a smaller one. Oh. Okay, let's see. It depends how it looks. That one. I'm gonna hold that for later. Let me hold that for later. Maybe I'll go another layer up. Yeah, let me do that. You know what? I don't care. Let me just noodle along with it. 
Because if this stinks, it just stinks. It's just uh, too big. You think somebody said it's too big. How are you? I'm good, Pixel. What's up? Okay, let me see. All right, let's try the smaller one. Oh, man, I'm running low. Okay. Okay, let's see. Yeah, maybe that one might be better. Yeah, maybe that one might be better. Good call. Good call, good call. Okay. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take two of these and tie them together. And make this sole. Okay. Just joined. Twister Kid, what up? Good to see you again. Hey, I followed your Facebook page, man. Did you see? Good work, by the way. Do you hear Star Bomb songs? No, no, I haven't. I don't know that one. I don't know any of that. Because I'm old, remember. I'm old. I'm married with a kid. I'm no fun anymore. So you guys got to keep me up to speed with all the new stuff. You got to tell me all, all, the, all the good stuff to listen to and to watch and all that stuff. Did you see my Bowser? I did not see the Bowser. I saw the pumpkin you were talking about. But I didn't see Bowser. I don't know if this is going to be terrible. Or what? Do I want to bring this over in? You know what? I'll try it. I don't care. Let's try it. Let's see. Sorry, I'm not really looking at the uh, hurry. <laughs> Let me go. Somebody says hurry. This is going to take a minute, Mr. Hurry Up. That's funny, though. Dude, big balloon projects like this take a while. I think my dad should post it soon. Oh, the thing. Okay, cool, cool. No, that'd be cool. I'd like to see it. That'd be great. I'm glad we could inspire you to make you some cool stuff. All right, so this... This is gonna be a mess. I know it. I just feel it in my bones. This is gonna be a mess. Ugh. Ugh. And it's like when you're working with really big balloons, not to mention I'm too close to the camera. You guys aren't seeing most of everything. But when you're working with really big balloons, it's like you almost wrestle with them. It's not like you even make them, you just wrestle. Hmm. I wonder if I should use these and tie them together here. Let's just try that. Let's do this. Okay. There. Now, if I were to make this this part for the client, like for the like the real deal, I would. I wouldn't make the front of the sneaker using two balloons because this kind of this these twists here kind of look ugly. I would just take one and twist it all the way around. But you know, letting you guys behind the curtain a little bit. Okay, uh, there we go. Okay, now this looks like a complete mess. Complete mess for now. But, hopefully, when I get it all together, it'll come together. Did you see the Mario movie? I did not. Eric said he saw it. He said it was good. For a kid movie, he said it was fun. Alright, so... This... There's a rough sole. There's the body. So I need to make another layer of... Pretty much everything. I need to do another layer of everything. I'm going to do another layer of orange and white we'll see i'm gonna make them a different size though i'm gonna do a smaller orange oh, okay okay it's gonna be the heel here like this like this like uh, right around there oh man i 
shouldn't have worn a long sleeve shirt. It's hot in here. I might even have to do another version of this another day off camera just to try to figure all this out because uh, I'm not particularly confident in this. I'm not confident. Oh, there's, you know what? There's the white I said I was going to need. Okay. All right, let's do this. Let me just check in and say hi. A couple people on tonight. We got okay. We got 12 people on on YouTube, which isn't that much, but that's all right. And we got uh, like 100 people on TikTok. That's cool. Hey everybody, I always ask this on my lives. Give me a location check. Give me a location check. Where is everybody? Anybody from outside the United States or everybody in the states here? I'm outside of Philly. What about you guys? Where are you guys? L.A. Oh, L.A.'s in the house. All right. Three hour time difference. I get it. Let's go. Who else is here? Philly. Good. What's up, Philly? Alaska? Are you real? Are you being serious? Jersey? That's cool. Who else is here? Who else is here? Florida, New York City, Washington State, Detroit, Wisconsin. Oh yeah, Twister Kids, Wisconsin. I remember that from the other day. Italy? Get, get out of here. Italy's in the house. What's up? It's Italy. Okay, this is going to be a little narrower. I see what I gotta do here. I gotta triple it up. Doubling it up ain't gonna work. Who else? Where are we at? Alabama, Michigan, Arkansas. What's up, everybody? Thank you for tuning in, everybody. So here, I'm sure uh, I'm sure TikTok doesn't like to hear this, like the platform, but um, I, when I stream live on TikTok, I'm always in portrait mode, so you're only getting a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of a, a, of a space to watch, but when I stream on, uh, on YouTube, I'm in pla I'm in portrait mode, or I'm in landscape mode, so you can see more of the thing. So if you guys want a bit of a wider view, you can check me out on YouTube live right now, because I'm live on YouTube. So if you want a wider view, come to YouTube. All right, let me see here. And plus, I think uh, that's cool because if you guys were in the live with me and Eric the other night, you know that YouTube Live actually pays us. And TikTok does not. Because, you know, TikTok, whatevs. All right. So here, there's a second layer. Yeah, I don't know. This might stink. This might stink. We're going to see. We're going to see. So I don't want to do another layer of, of orange on the front. I think I probably have to do white on the front because that's like the... That's like the toe box of the sneaker here, right up here. The white, I think that is going to be next. All right, so we'll see. So no more orange in the front, but we'll do white on the front. Oh, what am I doing? Okay. Wait. All right. Oh, man. You can make your TikTok widescreen too, you know? Oh, I didn't know that. I thought you could only, I thought they only did uh, vertical. I didn't think TikTok did, did land, landscape anything. That's crazy. Where are you from? I'm from Philly. I'm from outside of Philly. I'm in the Philly suburbs. All right, so let's see here. All right. Oh, man, I'm nervous about this. I am definitely nervous about this here. This might stink so bad. Alright. So let's start pulling this thing together into something cohesive, right? Do you like cats? Yeah, they're cool. I had cats growing up my whole life. But I have a dog now, because I married a woman who has a dog. So I inherited the dog. 
I didn't go out of my way to get this dog, but I inherited her. Alright, how do I want to do this? I think I know. I think I know. I hope. I don't wanna. I think I gotta do this in sections. That's cool. Sadie, that's a good name. Three cats. That's an option for your live. Look into it next time live. I will. Thanks, McFlurry. Thanks, everybody else who uh, told me about that, too, because I had no idea. I had absolutely no clue. Let's see here. Let's see here. So I, right now, I'm using a balloon, a smaller balloon, and I'm pulling it through for all the balloon people in the, in the, in the, in the live here. I'm using an uninflated balloon, and I pulled it real tight in the toe to kind of keep all these together. Because I know they want to pull apart, but if you pull it in real tight, it, it kind of holds it in. And I'm going to put this in here. I got a leaker somewhere. Oh, when you're making a balloon, like a big one, and you hear that hiss, some of the air coming out, nothing worse, nothing worse. Because you know you're fixing something. Ah, oh, there it is. It's only this guy. That's all right. I don't mind if it's that one. It's not as big a deal. Man, this looks, right now, this looks like trash, but I, I, I got, I have a vision in my head. I do. There's, there's something floating around in my head. Whether it's going to look good or not is another question, but <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Uh, let's go, Cowboys. Oh, man. <laughs> Did you watch one of my other videos? Uh, yeah, I'm in Philly, man. That's like sacrilege to say, let's go, Cowboys. Okay, I need an orange one here. This guy. Wait a minute. What do I want to do? I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Hang on, guys. Hang on. I'm just thinking. That's as high as that's going to go. But I need another layer of white. That's enough orange, and I need, I need to do this. I think I'm going to do this in gray. Even though it's not gray, it's, it's off-white. I'm going to do it in gray. Did your brain turn off? Sometimes it feels like it turns off. Sometimes you freeze up. You're like, ugh, there's so much to do. No, no, I'm just debating how I want to do this. Because if you plan ahead a little bit, it makes the process easier sometimes on the back end. But if you just go with your first thought... Sometimes you end up getting screwed and like on the back end things just get 10 times harder. So sometimes you just got to stop and just think a little bit. Um, yeah, this guy, this stripe, this stripe here, it's, um, it's white. It's like an off white. It looks like, or it looks like it's like a, like a, like a suede or something. But, um, I don't think I'm going to make it white in the sneaker. I think I want to make it gray because the white and the white and the white, it'll just kind of like, it'll blend together and you'll lose it. You'll, it'll, you'll lose all that cool detail. So, you know, hang on. I think I'm going to do gray. Let me see it. No, I don't want to do that one yet. I don't want to do that. Why are you guys making me do that? You guys throw me off my game. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Let me see. You know what I want to do? I think I know what I want to do. Let's take this guy. So, to kind of fill out this heel section, to kind of fill out the heel, who said something? I missed it. I made a small Bowser, and I decided to make a bigger Bowser. Oh, yeah, cool, man. Yeah, man, check it out. So, if those of you guys like balloons, this dude on, in YouTube is Dan Twister Kid. He's a young kid, but he's into balloon art, and he's, uh, he's, he's pretty good. He's got some skills. Check him out. Okay, so, again, I'm going to use this inflated balloon inside these loops, and I'm going to pull it. And it's going to keep everything real tight so that nothing like bubbles out. Let's 
So you see, you see what I was talking about, about size? You see how important the size is? Um, this pops out a little bit too far. And if I make it again, I would take these pinch twists out of the way and I would just round it out and, and I would make sure that the balloons line up just like this instead of having it come in. But we'll see. We'll see how this all goes. There's those two, there's that, and we need to add. What do I want to add? What do I want to add? I want to add the middle white, and I want to add the gray. Yeah, I do want to add the gray. I want to add the gray around here. Let's do that. Oh, look, look at this. I brought iced tea. Totally didn't even realize. All right, here we go. Let's do this. I am going to give myself a lot of, like, an untied, or I'm sorry, a lot of uninflated balloon on the end because I use it to tie stuff in. So, like this. This is going to be the back of that heel, so I'm going to have this come up here. Maybe I'll just run it through here, and I'll just kind of do this or whatever. I think, anyway. Okay, so this is going to come up and across. It's gonna come up and back, because I think this one I'm gonna make a skinnier piece. So up and back across. Let's see. So this is gonna come up like that. Man, I am totally off camera. And around like that. And then I'm, I gotta get another one, because I didn't put enough air in it. Okay. Mm, yeah. Okay. Tie that in this side. I keep forgetting. Sorry, you two. I'm too close. I'm too close to the camera. Okay. This one's got to come up to about to about here. All right. Ooh, man, these big balloons are tough. You got, like I said, you don't just make them; you wrestle them. If I'm making a big piece, I'm usually sitting down. I'm usually sitting down at a, at a on a desk chair because I use I use all kinds of stuff to stabilize edges and then whatever. But now I'm trying to do this standing. Wait, wait. All right, no leaker, no leaker. Good. I'm using doing the standing to try and uh, make this look good on camera. Two. Round two. I'm gonna wrap this. No, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go inside first. Oh man, I am off camera. Here you go. Now I'm gonna wrap it around here. I'm just saying hi to everybody. What's going on, everybody in TikTok? How you doing? Nike Air Force. That's what we're trying. Red, gray, white look good together in general. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I agree. The red is going to look way better than the orange. What is the weirdest party theme I got? The weirdest one? Huh. I don't know. I get a lot of cute ones for, like, first birthdays and stuff. You know, like Mr. Wonderful and, you know, all that kind of stuff. It's, it's adorable for one-year-olds. But weird ones? I don't get weird party themes. I get, I get weird individual requests. Somebody once asked me, a little kid asked me, unironically, for a, a shark eating broccoli. <laughs> I was like, all right, I like what you're thinking. I like it. <laughs> so, yeah, but themes, I don't get really weird themes. Adding it to a column, yes, I'm going to add it to a column. I think I might need to make it a little bigger than this. 
If I'm going to put it on a column, I might need to make it a little bigger, but we'll see what the final product looks like. So the back heel part, I need a little more support. That's a weird request. What's a, what's a weird request? The uh, the shark eating broccoli? Yeah, that's a, that was a little goofy. So I need a little more support in here, so I'm going to add a second inflated balloon, just the stuff inside of it, just to keep it more solid so it doesn't collapse and flop around and stuff. Come on, wrestling with it. You can be mean to these balloons sometimes. If they're not, if they're not agreeable, you just show them who's boss. Okay. So, so I stuffed. Give me a second. There we go. So I stuffed the second balloon in the in the heel ankle portion because really what that does, you're not going to see it, but what it's going to do is it'll help, it'll help the heel keep its shape as, I, as it's stressed and as I move things around. So, you know, hopefully. Hopefully that'll do that. Uh, I, can ask. I had a kid ask for an armadillo. That's a good one. It's larger than a 36 inch. I will see. This isn't that large. This isn't that long. The shoe so far is only, hold up, I got my measuring tape out. Let's see, this is... What, what is this? It's only about 30 inches long. It's only 30 inches long. So we'll see. But we'll see. No, it's all right. We're going we're gonna to keep going. Um, I don't know what to do with that. All right. I need another. I think I'm going to do another white of, the, of this same size right here. Maybe I should do. I don't know. Let me. I haven't decided. Okay. Let me see. Oh, look, I got a leaker already. I feel like Eric. <laughs> Constantly getting leakers and fixing them on the back end. <laughs> I'm just teasing if Eric's listening. I'm just teasing the brother. All right, so let me see here. Do I want to make it that big or do I want to make it that big? Probably this big. Let me try, let's just try this big. Again, this is practice, right? Sometimes they work out, sometimes they don't. All right. But you know what, look here. Because this thing pops. I know it's going to be a mess. I'm going to get rid of it anyway, because you know that's where it was headed. And I will take this, and we'll just start here. And that's how we'll work our, our, our fixing the mistake in. There. And again, this ain't going to look perfect. This isn't going to be perfect, but it'll make it work. We'll make it work for the live. Oh, okay. Okay. So now I have to take this, bring it up here. orange thing I don't know what I want to do with it so I'm just getting rid of it because I don't know what to do with it I have no clue so this one I'm going to tuck this white thing in the middle and then I have to add a couple more Open a new bag.
All right, so this is going to go back and forth a couple of times. This is going to be the middle section of the sneaker. So we're going to see how this goes. You know, sometimes when I'm doing live, I, I, when I'm doing lives, I feel guilty for not saying anything to you guys for a couple seconds. And then I realize that Eric, when we're doing lives, sometimes he just walks off camera for a few minutes. So I don't feel so bad. Eric, you watching? Love you, brother. Okay. Let me see here. Tie these together. Hmm. I, gotta, I have to tuck this, this free end, I have to tuck it in somewhere so it doesn't go flopping around. So I put a twist in this orange one and tie in this orange one together. Oh, come on. Come on. All right, I got this. I was close. Right. Trying to step back so I can be more in the shop. But in my bedroom here, the spare bedroom is so small, not a lot of room. with so far I'm making animation while watching me that's cool that's pretty cool what's the biggest thing I made alone <laughs> so the bigger it gets the bigger you get the harder it is right so the biggest thing I ever made alone I'll still say alone it was a piece that I made I actually had a title it was called of dreams and it was a guy laying in a, a bed full size it was a guy laying in bed with a blanket over him, and there was like a dream, like like the bubbles coming out of his head, and in his dream, um, it, he was hugging his his wife or his girlfriend who was jumping into his arms. Um, it was pretty cool. Took me about 55 hours to make. Now, full disclosure, a couple of my friends helped me inflate some balloons. Like they helped me blow them up, and they just laid them down for when I needed them, but nobody actually did any of the work except for me. So I wouldn't have been able to do it without my friends helping me blow the balloons up, but in fairness, I did do all the work work, like the design work by myself. So yeah, that was the biggest thing I ever made alone. He's making a Nike sneaker. What's up? Thanks for, thanks TikTok peeps. All right, let's see, Where? let me keep going. I'm getting distracted. So you know what I wanna do? Just to give this guy some shape, um, the front end of the shoe, this little red part here, if you don't mind, what do you do to win the Broken Pump Award? Oh, the Broken, you know, Jasmine, you know that one? All right, so for those of you guys in, in the lives who aren't balloon artists, there's this convention that happens once a year. It's really where I cut my teeth competing and making big stuff because this is where I was exposed to really good balloon artists. Hang on, give me a second, you guys. So, ghetto rig, I am ghetto rigging this, uh, this phone. I am taping it up with painter's tape. The, the, uh, the TikTok phone, I'm taping it up with painter's tape and the tape's starting to break. So I just had to add a little extra tape so it doesn't fall down on me. Okay, uh, anyway, the, the, uh, the, the convention I cut my teeth at with competing was called Twist and Shout. It's still going now, actually. It's a fantastic convention. So for anybody who's a new balloon artist who wants to like really see what real competition's about and see what real talent level's about, go to Twist and Shout. It's a must, it's a must do thing. So look up, look up Twist and Shout um, Balloon Convention, for sure. But the Broken Pump Award is like kind of an unofficial fun thing we do there. Um, Sorry, it's an unofficial thing we do there where uh, people get together and they do like little competitions and the winners of those little competitions take home the broken pump. Um, there's a whole story behind it, which I'm not gonna tell here. You gotta go to Twist and Shop to know the story. It's pretty funny, um, but that's the deal. I won the broken pump once. I think it was like 2011, maybe. I forget, but it was cool. Oh, man, okay. All right, let's see what I wanna do here. 
So, what, like I said before, what I want to do now is I want to make this part of the uh, of the sneaker, right? The front the front red part that kind of comes up over the top. That's what I'm going to do. Yep. All right. So again, let's tie this in here. Up here like that okay I don't want to go too high I want it kind of flat because you don't want it too bulbous actually you guys I have I have taught uh, classes at Twist and Shout a couple of times. Um, and they're, they're starting to look for uh, teachers for, for next year's Twist and Shout. Um, I was thinking about going back to teach. Uh, Eric, actually, Eric and I were thinking about going back to teach at Twist and Shout this upcoming year in 2020. What is it? 2024. Um, for those balloon twisters in the group, would you guys want to see us teach a twist and shout? Would that be something cool? Is the tickets to twist and shout? Uh, Twister Kid, I don't know what you're asking. Ask that again. Okay, so there's the front of that. I know in a real in a real Nike Air or in a real Air Jordan, it doesn't go all the way over the top. It's split, but we're going to suspend with this balloon. You should definitely teach. I'd like to. I think I'm going to apply. If Eric and I come up with something that's that's cool enough, hopefully they'll select us to teach. That'll be fun because we've taught before. Both Eric and I have taught at Twist and Shout in the past. Uh, we've taught together as the balloon guys, and we've taught separately by ourselves. Uh, he's making a Nike sneaker. Hey, thanks people in the TikTok comments for keeping people uh, abreast of the situation. <laughs> Where's the other guy? He's uh, he's at his house. He's sleeping or playing video games or whatever. I'm doing this on my own tonight. I'm, I'm going solo. Yeah, sometimes we go live together. Sometimes we go by ourselves. You know, it's whatever. But yeah, he's at his place. So here's this. Now, now I think I want to, I think I want to start to angle this up right here. Because what I want to do, there's gray. Where's my gray? What I want to do here is... This part here, I want to make a gray one coming forward, a skinnier one. So this, I'm backing up so everybody can see. This part's coming forward. It's going to come forward like this. Sorry, YouTube. It's going to do that. So we're going to see how that goes. Let's see. All right. Um, I don't know what to do. Sorry, YouTube, I keep drifting closer to the camera because I can't see the comments because I need glasses. And then I get so close you can't see the balloons. Hang on, TikTok. I'm going to help out YouTube here. Hang on, hang on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tilt this camera down just a smidge so you can see it a little better. So I tilted the camera down. You might not be able to see my ugly mug, but you'll be able to see this a little better. So this, this might be too small. That might be too small. What do you guys think? This one right here. Is that too small? Should I go back with a bigger one? I don't know. All right, let's 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 just keep messing around. We'll just keep messing around and see what happens, right? That's what practice is all about. Press the thumbs up. How do I do it? Where's the thumbs up? I don't even know. Okay. Um... Hmm. Hmm. All right, let's just, you know what? I'm just doing it. If the proportions are off, that's okay. Woo! Okay. All right, let me see this here. Yeah, okay. I think I know what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna take this, 
See, this is what happens when you don't plan. Remember earlier I said planning ahead helps you? So I want to take these balloons and thread them through the white one, but I already put the orange one here on it. So now I gotta, I'm gonna have to fight with it just to get it done. That's what I mean, planning ahead helps. Um, yeah, I'll do this. Cheating. Cheating. this up. I'm barefoot peeps. This is going to come up here like this. That's going to be the top of the sneaker and this is going to come up in here to, to meet it. So let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. sloppy when I'm practicing. So all these little extra ends that I didn't do anything with, I would cut them off. But for, for this, I'm just going to leave it on there. So I doubled it up, made it a little thicker. Again, I might end up using the, 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 the bigger balloon for it and the real deal one, but I'm practicing. So I got to get another gray one for the other side. I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm not confident about this. But we're going to see how it goes. I gotta make the same length of this on the other side. I guess that's it. said earlier, why don't you just weave it? <laughs> now weaving, for those of you guys who aren't balloon artists, and weaving is just another technique, right? It's another way I can go about achieving the look that I want to achieve. Hmm. Let's look at it. But if this ends up looking trash, I might end up weaving it. We'll see. We'll see. When this is done, we'll see how it looks. Okay, so let me turn it this way so you guys can sort of see. So that's sort of where we're going with this. Sorry, TikTok. There you go. So that's sort of where we're going with this. I obviously have to add laces and I have to add some other stuff, but that's the general idea. I'm going to have to noodle around with some proportions here, but... All right, let's see. Where do I want to go next? I want to do a little white guy, a little white piece right in the middle there, so... Oh, and the tongue's white. I thought the tongue was red. All right, so this should be fun. Maybe I'll just add that in the middle. Maybe I'll just put the white one in there, and that'll pop out. Okay. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. No, I'm just kidding. How crazy would that be if I passed out on live? That would be bananas. I'd expect one of you guys to call the authorities or something. Got to make this thing interesting somehow, you know what I mean? Them dogs barking. Ha! About my feet. That's hilarious. Where I see you to make dry bones from Super Mario movie. Oh, what's up? Oh, Isaiah. Yeah, I remember your name from the other day. Thanks for coming back. That's cool. 
night. So let's see if I can sneak this white one in here. This one will be the tongue. It's a little narrow, but it's okay. So again, I gotta fit this in there somehow and tie it in there somehow. Ah! Ah. All right, so did that stick? Good enough, good enough for the practice. So this is, this is going to be in here like this. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Hmm. It's going to be there. You know what? You know what I want to do? I'm going to tie this in. I'm going to make a little pinch twist here. Oh, come on, dude. Really? So I'm putting a little bubble here, right where the gray comes in, just to kind of secure it. Who's talking at me? Matt Steed, what's up? Hey, you were in the other live the other day too, what's up? Okay, good to see you back. Thank you, good to see you back. You got this, thanks Janet. Is that, did I read your name right? Yeah, thanks Janet Vargas. Turn around. Okay. All right, let's see, let's see. Get up here. Get up here. Right, now they used to go vertical. That's why I did that. I know I did that on purpose, right? Yeah, I did that on purpose. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's it. I'll, I'll just keep telling myself that. Okay. And this is going to come up. So, yeah, I think I'll loop, the, I'll loop the tongue up here like this. What's going on, Matt? Thanks for all those emojis, man. I don't even know what's going on with that. Make a Mark's balloon in the future. All right, fish stick. What's a Mark's balloon? I don't know. Are, are we talking about Karl Marx, the father of communism? I don't know. What, what is Marx? Enlighten me. How you doing? What's up, Matt? I'm doing all right. I'm a little tired, but I'm good. Looks sick already. Hey, thanks, pickup truck. Appreciate that. I'm, uh, I'm hoping it'll finish nice. You got to finish strong, though. So, look. This is the shoe. I think I'll loop it up like that to be the tongue. Why not? Just because why? Why not? Who cares? Okay. Uh, but I have to keep this narrow up here. So let's just see how this works. Let's just see how this works. Ah, I think, okay. I think I know what I'm going to do. I think. I hope. So I'm going to take the tongue and I'm going to bring it all the way in like this. And then I'm going to loop it. Oh. What do you think? That's high enough? The tongue? Think the tongue's high enough? I think so. I think it's high enough. I was going to... I was going to cut this part off, but I could probably just tuck it in there and leave it. Alright, so this is going to be like this. These are going to come up here. I mean, look, I'm looking at this picture here. Just like you guys, I'm looking at this picture here. How am I going to do this? So it's going to come up and around. I got to sneak a couple of black ones. I got to, yeah, I got to sneak a couple of black little pieces in there too, just to kind of give it a little depth. Where am I going to fit them in? I'll, I'll figure something out. I'll figure something out. Uh, all right, let's see. All right, here. Where do I go? Where do I want to go? All right, these are going to have to stay. These are going to have to stay because this... Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. All right. So I put... So with balloons, every, you work in lines. All right. Everything you do is a line. And so like if I were to make my face out of balloons, I wouldn't work... You know, when you have a pencil, you can do shading and you can do circles or whatever, but everything I do has to be a straight line or some variant of it. So if I make an ear, I don't draw little sticks. I have to draw a straight line and loop it. Or my nose has to be a line. Everything's just a line because that's the paintbrush that I have to work with. So I need to connect those lines to pieces when I make balloons. So this guy, the tongue, I made a little, this is called a pinch twist because you pinch it and twist it. Pretty self-explanatory. But this is a great place for me to connect things. So I want to make this next part 
right above the gray, I need to make some, some, some orange. And where I want to connect that is going to be right there. So that should be pretty dope. All right, let's see how this works out. Let's see how this works out. I mean, I think I got this. All right, I think, I think this might actually work out. What's my favorite animal? Hmm. In general or out of balloons? And this is, this is good too because it'll hold the tongue down where I want it to. I think, I think it will. That doesn't stay in, I'm gonna I'll kick it out. But look, this loop, I'm making a big loop. There you go. See the, the other loop right there it adds to the back of the sneaker. And then you just connect it to the tongue, and now it's gonna keep the tongue in place. And uh, it'll add it'll help me add to this part too. Yeah. Alright. Get rid of this. Come on. Sometimes I wonder what my face looks like when I'm wrestling with these big balloons. And then I don't have to wonder. I actually look at what I look like when I'm doing these lives and I look like a goof. Marks is a Kirby character. Okay, thank you very much. Now I actually can look it up and I'll be able to figure it out. But there we go. Okay, I need... I don't want to hold this down. Huh, maybe I do want that there. I want this puffed out here. You know what? I will get rid of this. Because these are these are a little bit forward, and I want that tongue sticking out. Can we see everything you see? Right. I'm gonna use a scrap white one. Because I don't like where this tongue is. I want it pulled down real tight. So I'm going to use a scrap white. Just one little piece of trash. And I'm going to pull it down into the balloon to keep it where I want it. Heel, or the, I'm sorry, the, the back of the heel right there. Um, where do I want to go with this? Maybe I shouldn't have gone that far down. Okay, so look, this is going to be a part that's going to be messed up. So the tongue, which is this, is going to be too far down in there because I connected it in a weird spot. And I got to figure now. I got to figure out how I'm going to fix it in the back end. I gotta think about how I'm gonna fix it. Okay. All right, so check this out. That might not be the tongue. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, yep, got rid of it. How are you gonna do the logo? What, this thing? What, this logo? I don't know if that I'm gonna. I don't know that I'm gonna do the logo. Somebody asked me how I'm gonna do the logo. I don't think I'm gonna do that. I'm, if I do, I might just draw it on, or I might just say forget it. I might not do it. I have an idea how I want to do the Nike swoosh though, so we'll we'll see. I have an idea about how I want to do that one. I need orange. Yeah, orange is terrible color. Terrible color. But again, looks good against my shirt. Right, let's see. So I'm gonna do it right now. I'm doing another. I'm doing another thing. Look at these dogs. These dogs are barking. So I'm doing another loop here and kind of pull up against the back of the sneaker like that. Okay. I'm gonna tie it up. 
And you know what's crazy? As loud as I am, because I feel like I am yelling, my wife and daughter, they sleep through all this. I don't know how. <laughs> I honestly don't know how. But hey, they sleep through it. Um, all right. Let's see where I want to go. This is going to slide on here. This is going to be this part. This is going to go here. So we're starting to get a little shape. We're starting to get a little shape, right? All right. Um, don't know how I'm going to do this. Guys. Okay, guys. Question. Look at my proportions. They're not perfect, but should I do another layer of orange up here? Or should I just do black and then and then loop and call it at the top? I think I probably should just do black. Will we be at Bling Bling Jam in Vegas in July? Balloon Josh. Hey, what's going on, dude? Uh, no, unfortunately, I will not. Uh, I can't get the time off work. I'm a physical therapist. I only have so much time, so I can't get time off. But Eric, um, Eric, the other half of the balloon guys, He's a school teacher and he's done school obviously in July. So Eric will be at Bling Bling Gym. So you guys can uh, you guys can hang out there. Uh, Majestic Party Reynolds is going to be there. What's up? Okay, so yeah, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it to black and I'm just going to line it at the top with black because I think I'm kind of there already. Let's see. Right, let's see here. All right, and I might do a skinny black, not a not a fat one. Ah, eh, well, you know, let's just. Let's just noodle with it. Let's noodle with it and see what happens. Is this brown or black? I don't even know my own colors. I don't even know how I organize my stuff. These are beat. Okay. That's too big. That's that's too big. I can already. That's. I can confidently say that now. How do I want to do this? Let me think. Okay. All right. Sorry. I blanked out a second. I blanked out. But I think I got it. I think I got. It. I think I'm. I think I know what I want to do. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Yeah! Yeah, this is kind of, this version is kind of trash, but it's okay. That's okay. No big deal, man. All right, so also I am going to, oh man, did I make these not even? Oh, yeah, I didn't make these even. I forgot this one. Good Lord. All right, so this is the high rise part of the high top. This is going to come to the very top edge of the shoe. And I don't know, I was going to use orange, but no, it's a white, it's a white tongue, so I got to use white, right? No, no, I'll use a skinny white one. Well, I got to restock my bag. What's the biggest thing I made completely alone, completely alone without any help? Um, I made in 2014 at Twist and Shout, right? I'm telling you guys, for all you balloon twisters watching here, Twist and Shout is the place to be. If you want to get better at balloons, if you want to see what's out there and who's really got some stuff going on, Twist and Shout is where it's at. I thought, let, let me tell you, years ago, years ago, uh, I entered a balloon competition, a local one, because there was a guy... There was a guy who was teaching the, at this this local like a, a local seminar. A guy who was teaching. His name uh, his name was Don Caldwell. He changed his name. His name is Buster Balloon Caldwell. For those of you guys who know him, he was teaching this thing, and they had a competition with the thing. And they said, make whatever you can make that fits through the door. And I made like a big dragon. At the time, I thought it was insane. I thought it was super advanced. But uh, I look back at it now, and I'm like, it's super cringy because. 
it, there was so much more I learned about how to make balloons well since then. Um, but at the time, it was this dope piece. And he saw it, and he goes, oh, you, you look like you got some, you got some skills. He said, you should go to this competition or this convention called Twist and Shout. And I was like, hmm, okay, I'll check it out. So I checked it out, and it looked cool. I was like, I'm going to go, I'm going to compete, and I'm going to show everybody what Philly's all about. Right? I went in there, I was just like, I'm going to come in and I'm going to blow these people out of the water. Because I was pretty confident. I was For the Philly market, I was it. And I went in there and I made this big devil. For those of you guys who saw the movie Legend back in like 1985, um, the evil, the villain, uh, Tim Curry, played basically the devil. He played evil. And, and the guy had these giant horns. It was so awesome looking. Um, but I, I took inspiration from that and I made this big devil. And I thought it was the best thing ever. I took it out. I'm like, yeah, everybody's going to like this thing. I sit it down and I look around and the balloons that everybody else had just like absolutely eviscerated mine. Mine was just so basic compared to what everybody else had going on. Um, I was very humbling. It was a very humbling experience. There are so many really good artists out there. You go there, you will learn fast and you will learn well. So that is the spot. Um, <coughs> anywho... But yeah, so to speak to that, you will learn fast and you will learn well because I, um, that year was 2009. I just got destroyed. But then by 2011 or 2012, I was already placing in competitions, getting like thirds and seconds. And then finally I got what was called Top Twister in 2014. I think it was 14. So I, my learning curve was pretty steep and I learned a lot really fast. It was awesome. Can, can, can you make darkness? Wow. Well, I sort of I sort of made darkness. I made my version of darkness. Um, you know, it was okay. It wasn't the best ever, but I was happy with it. So you have to bring your own balloons. Yeah, I would. If you're really competing and you're really you're really going to go for something big, I would bring your own balloons because they do have free samples there. But um, you might not be able to get all the ones that you need for your piece. And you might not be able to get them in time. So, yeah, bring the balloons that you need for the competition piece you're going to make. For sure. I'm just conserving balloons here. I'm trying not to be wasteful. Right, so where was I? What was I doing? I don't even know what I was talking about. I don't even know what balloon I was making. Who knows what's going on here? By the way, you guys, so I know some of you saw the movie, uh, Legend, the movie, just okay, but the makeup they put on Tim Curry for that villain, oh my goodness, it was awesome, right? That was incredible makeup. All right, so let's see here. What I'm trying to do here, at least my thought, is get down here. This is going to be the very top rim of the balloon. Because what happens? Come on, come on, come on. Whew, geez. All right. All right, man. Enough of this nonsense. Enough of this nonsense. Okay, so there's my, there's my sneaker. I might, add, I might add a couple black pieces in the back. Now, see this, I want to be a little more compact. It doesn't want to stay down. So I'm going to try a little trick and see if it works. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a pinch twist a little, bit, a little bit below the level of this. And hopefully that pinch twist will be enough to kind of like wedge this section underneath it. And it'll hold it in place, hopefully. We're, we're, I don't know. We're going to see if it works. Sorry, TikTok. Did I just step out of frame? All right, let's try this. So, see, I, I put a little pinch twist there. You probably won't even see it when it's all said and done. And I am going to, I guess, loop it around this guy. Some of this stuff, some of this stuff, you literally don't even know how you're going to make it until you're in the process of making it. You're like, oh, you know what? That'll work. Mm, just keep going. Which is kind of like what I'm doing right now. Uh, uh, 
Come on. You didn't do it? Oh, goodness. Oh, man. Okay. This thing needs to be tucked in. Because I don't want anybody to really see it. Like that. Mm. Okay. Uh, and this obviously needs to go. So I will tie this right here. Mess up a little bit. Right? Okay, so we're getting somewhere, right? It's not perfect yet, but we're getting somewhere. See, like a lot of this when I when I see this stuff. So, okay, I'm gonna give you guys the inside line. So for those of you guys who are going to go to Twist and Shout, and I again, I highly recommend you go. But if you're going to go, and if you're going to compete, here's a big thing. You got other absolute, like, God-tier twisters competing with you. So you need little things that you might, that might, thank you, by the way. Thank you, Denise. It's not done yet. We're going to still keep going. Um, little things that might not matter when you're with your clients. Like if you have a not exposed, or if you have like a little bit of this exposed, stuff like this. Your clients don't care about this, but when you're competing, it matters. Everything has to be absolutely as clean as possible. You want as few extra twists and extra bubbles, the, the fewest amount of extra bubbles and twists as you can possibly get in there. Everything has to be as clean as you can make it, okay? Um, where is the show, by the way? Fish stick. Are you asking about the convention that I'm talking about? Twist and shout? Each year it's in a different part of the world, or it's a different part of the country rather. So um, this year I think it's in the central part of the country. I think it's, we don't have this, I don't think there's a location for it yet, but I think it might be in like St. Louis or Chicago or maybe Nashville, somewhere, it's gonna be somewhere in that area this year. But yeah, you want everything super clean. You want everything super clean, like this. See this? See this little sloppy little thing hanging out and you can kind of see it? Nobody likes that. You got to be super careful. But anyway, but again, this is only practice. This is for a client, so no big deal. All right, so I don't like it. You see, it's kind of bowing. It's kind of bowing downwards like that. Not a fan. Uh, I, I'll, I'll fix that later. I'll fix it like when I, when I remake it. Mm. Mm. When I remake it, I'll change up the proportions a little bit. Um... All right, so let me think. What do I want to add? I definitely want to add a, some black in there in a couple of spots. So I think, so this is popping out. So I think I can add a skinny black one to kind of just to give it a little bit of, a little bit of, a little something. Man, did I run out? Good Lord, yeah, I got to repack my bag. Mm. I don't know if this is going to be too much. You're really talented and skilled. Thank you very much. Thanks, family. I appreciate that. <laughs> I didn't just call him fam. His name is literally family is everything. That's funny. Okay, so is that going to be too much? That might be too much. See, now look. Now you see. Now that looks like crap because it's supposed to bow down and not up. So that doesn't look right. So I'm not gonna do that. So clearly that's something I'm gonna have to change um, on the next design. Maybe I can sneak in some of the black here on that part. So I will sneak it in here. I could use 160s, which are smaller, I could use 160s, sorry TikTok, which are smaller balloons than this. Um, I might have to. 
Let's see, let's see. Here. You know what I can do? Ah, okay. I'm gonna just make them like this, like this. <laughs> Alright everybody. Can you guys see what I'm doing here? No? Oh well, bummer. So again, because everything I did is kind of layered, uh, you know what? I quit. No, I'm just kidding. All right, let's try this again. Okay. All right, let's try this again. So I want to take, I'm going to add just a little bit of black right in here, just for some depth. So what I'm going to do is sneak it in underneath, sneak it in on this side underneath, and again, this is only practice, so it doesn't have to be absolutely picture perfect yet. Like, look, you see it up front there? To me, that's unacceptable, but we're only practicing, so we're going to see how this turns out. See, it's just, the black here just gives it a little bit of depth. And that's really what you're looking for. And there's a little bit, so look. So there's a little bit of black here, too. So maybe what I should have done was, all right. All right, I know what I'm going to do. All right, this, going. All right, let's try that again. Oh, my last two, my last two. All right. Right. How many people are hanging out? There's a few. There's a few. It's good. It's good to see you guys, man. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take these these balloons and I'm gonna make them just about as long as this gray section here. Maybe a smidge longer, but I'm gonna soften them up like absolutely crazy. And I'm gonna double them up like this. So they're really, really soft. I don't know if this is gonna sit where I want it to sit, but that's why you practice. And I hope the client likes this. Okay. Now I'm gonna do the same on the other side. Squish it, squish it, soften it. Looks great to me. Thank you so much, Yasmin, I appreciate that. I really do. But you know how clients can be, you guys. Sometimes they can be very demanding. They forget that when we're doing balloons, there are some limitations. <laughs> you know how they get. Let me talk to my let me talk to my TikTok people. Do I have any tattoos? That's kind of a private question, isn't it? Jeez. No, I don't though, actually. I don't have any don't have any private any tattoos. My body's a temple, folks. Look at this. Why would I ruin it with a tattoo? You don't put a bumper sticker on a Ferrari, okay? No tattoos. Alright. Animating is hard, bro. I can only imagine. I, I can't do it. All right, so now, instead of wrapping that thing around, I'm actually going to stuff this thing behind the gray, and it's going to sit there, and I'm going to kind of bulge it out on either side. And we're going to see if it works. Almost there. Getting there. Don't peek. No peeking. Okay, so there, it's like that. Just to give it, again, just to give it a little bit of depth. I'm going to do the same on the other side. Yeah, it's not perfect, but it's not bad either. It's not bad. I don't, I don't think I mind that. I need to do a little on this side too. So there's a little bit of there's a little bit of black right there. Okay. Now the tongue is unfinished. You see that mess? If I were to make it again, which I don't know that I feel like doing it, see how like wide and loose this is? I would make it again so that it 
pulls itself together a little more. I don't really like the way this is flaring out, but that's just me being a psycho. Watch, here, I'll show you this. If you don't feel like remaking the balloon, you just take this. And I'm gonna pull it in tight. And now, oh no, but you can still see it. Watch, I'll just roll this over top of it. Voila, vanished. But either way, so that got it a little tighter. Um, now what I want to do is actually want to make the tongue. I want to legit make the tongue because something went all weird with that. That doesn't work. That's, that's not working for me. Okay, so... Hmm. If I do another one... How do I want to do that? I'm thinking, guys. I'm thinking, you guys. How do I want to do the tongue? I'm going to do the swoosh symbol, but I'll do the swoosh symbol last. I want to get this tongue done. I don't want it to sit the way I want it to sit. So, you know what? Maybe I'll just hang on. Maybe I'll just cheese it. Maybe I'll just cheese it. <sighs> Woo! Okay. Okay. Hey, TikTok people, give me some likes. I know there's not many people in. 132 people. I'll let, throw those likes my way. We want to get this live moving. YouTube people, hook me up with some likes, man. I'd appreciate it. That would be awesome. That would be super rad. I like hanging out with you guys. Show me. Just like Eric did for Bowser. What did Eric do for Bowser? I don't remember. Begging for likes? <laughs> okay. Is that what we do sometimes? All right. So let me get this tongue here. I want to make it like that. That's too big. That's too big. Now I gotta set it backwards a little bit. Let's see what I can. See, sometimes I connected it. Distortion for the tongue. Oh, okay. Yeah, I could. I definitely could. I probably should, honestly. <laughs> I probably should. If Eric was here, he would yell at me. Do you distortion? What are you, you seriously going to be lazy? You going to be lazy? Probably. Yeah, probably. For the client. Oh, for sure. For, for sure. For right now just to get this done because i gotta go to bed remember what the suggestion i made wow wow guy no i don't actually because i i didn't even see your comment what was the suggestion you made wow wow guy tell me tell me i want to hear it i want to see it guys throw some likes my way come on hook me up throw some likes my way youtube throw some likes my way tiktok i love hanging with you guys you remember me? Oh, it's C Money, kid. Sorry, I didn't I didn't cash happy the money at C Money. Don't come after me. Don't break my legs. I'm a father. Come on, I'm a father. I need to take care of my kids. All right. Let me see here. Good to see you back, though, either way. Good to see you back. <laughs> the noise from Pizza Tower. It's my PFP. All right, I'm going to have to check that one out. Taking this tongue, and I gotta sneak it in here somehow. Look, it's too tall. tell you that right now. This is not perfect. But it's not bad either. So, 
so. Yeah. It's all right. It's all right. It's all right. Should I make it a little smaller, maybe? Mm. Again, it's not terrible. It's not amazing. But, uh... Well, it's something. <laughs> it's something, all right. all right. Let me see. Let me see. Let me think. All right, hang on. I want to fill something in because I'm seeing some gaps that I'm not liking. So I want to, you know, fix it. Yes, it's a shoe. It's a shoe. All right, so I'm on the right track, right? So for the, for you guys, for you TikTok people who are just coming in and just seeing it, not knowing what it is, if you know it's a shoe right off the bat, then at least I'm in the right ballpark, right? You don't have to look at it and be like, what the, what's this guy making? If you can just figure it out just by looking, then I mean, you know, I'm doing okay. So I think I want to add another little loop at the second level here. Right here. So for those of you guys who are asking, I know you don't know what I'm doing, but it's going to cost me. It's going to come together. Use my belly. Sorry, YouTube. Okay. All right, now this doesn't make any sense, but I'm going to swivel it around. Hide this inside. I wanted to, I was, I was seeing a little too much of the knots and stuff on the inside, so I wanted to add that there. And I kind of like it actually, like regardless. Like regardless of it, I kind of like it. do some laces. I got to do some laces. How am I going to do these laces? Okay, I could just cheese it. Probably will. Probably will just cheese it. Probably will. All right, let me see. Let me see something here. All right, so the tongue, the tongue's a little like the tongue hides too much on the top from the profile view. Can't see it, so I need to I need to add a little bit of bulk up here at the top of the tongue. I'm gonna grab it from the outside. Okay, there we go. Again, this is where planning comes into, comes into play. It's not happening, wow guy. <laughs> not tonight, not tonight. Not white laces. No, no, they're not going to be white laces. This is still the tongue. I'm going to make black laces, for sure. 100% black laces. It's just this is, uh, I want to kind of thicken up the tongue a little bit so you can see it from the side. Um, definitely not black, definitely not white laces, for sure. Right, where do I want to attach this? Where do I want to attach this? Where's my thing? Where's my thing? I need a scrap. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to take this. Line that up. Some skizzers. And again, I don't know how I want to attach this in, so I'm going to use a scrap piece. And I'm just kind of sneaking it inside the middle. 
Guess it doesn't matter. I lost the whole tongue. <laughs> I lost the whole tongue. So now I can I can just remake it as I want. Um, I don't even need this. I don't have to do it the hard way. I can do it my way. Okay, I think I know what I want to do. I'm going to make the tongue come from here. And I'm going to have it stop inside of here. use this for something else anyway. Mm. Alright, let's see. Let's see, I, I know I can do this. I know I can do this. Alright. See, look, now the tongue is going to be going to be sitting out where I want it to be because I don't want it too far out but I want it out far enough that when the laces go over it you guys can see it you know what I mean See, so now you can see the tongue from the sides. Oh, and this popped out. Of course it popped out. Why would it, why would it stay where I wanted it to be? Why would it stay? That would make too much sense. That would make it too easy if it stayed where I wanted it to stay. So you know what? I'm glad. I'm glad it popped out. It's like Bob Ross, right? It was happy little accidents. There are no mistakes. They're just happy little accidents. Okay. So there's my tongue. There's the thing. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Now, maybe the tongue is sticking too far out, but we're going to see. We're going to find that. We'll move it in there a little bit. Like that. But now we got this giant hole right in the middle there, right in the middle there. So uh, I had this for a reason, right? I'm just going to take it. Maybe a little smaller. Double it up. Actually, I can triple it up and quadruple it up. That might be too big, but we're going to find out. I got four. Wrap it around once. Mm. I'm just going to shove this inside this empty space so you can't see all that, you can't see that hole. going to nitpick, which I often do, I probably wouldn't do that in that. I would probably make that from that, just so I could do one instead of having multiple. But it's whatever. It's whatever. So. Okay. Now, the, the laces are going to be pretty easy in terms of how I make them. Uh, give me a second, you guys. Give me a second. Coming back. Coming right back. I'm not leaving you. I promise. All right. This is the easy part. Yeah, at least I think. In theory. In theory, it's easy. All right. So, 
it's going to seem super wasteful because I'm just going to take a balloon, blow it so there's just a little like puff of air in it, tie it up, do that maybe like six times, seven times, just like that. And hmm. So I was gonna just bar lace it, you know, like so that the laces are straight across like this, but that's clearly like lazy phoning it in. So let me see if I can get an X lace. Let me see if I can do it without messing it up. Oh my goodness. Right, I need an assistant for a whole bunch of this. Okay. So I'm going to have the laces like this going through it. Oh, uh, can I get more than one? No. Am I literally going to get one X per, per balloon? I'm going to get one X per balloon. Man, this is going to take like seven balloons, eight balloons. I'm going to get one X per layer here. This is going to take forever. Just like that. Okay, hang on. Right, you know what? I think I'm only gonna do six because I don't feel like doing my life. There we go. Two. Mm. Two more. I'm only gonna do three layers, three X's, because trying to practice. It's only practice, right? I'm not trying to use all my balloons on this. Ah, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Now, let's see. Can TikTokers see? Okay. Now I'm just tucking them in the back for now. If I was to sell this to the client, I really want to make sure they're secure because I don't want them popping out. So I would tie them back there somehow. It would take longer, it would be less fun to watch, but I would do it. So there's two. See what I'm saying? Look, they're popping out. They're popping out! And again, so you see how I have to lean on stuff to make this stay? That's why it's not good for video. If I was to do this the right way, it would look like it would look like crap on video. It would look terrible on video. The product would look dope, but the video would not be fun to watch. Okay, let's see if I can get these at least sort of in one place. Sorry, guys. These X's are not listening to me. These crisscrosses. Crisscross, man, there's a remember those guys? Any old people here? Any old people in this place? Anybody remember Crisscross? The, the little rap group for those little kids from the early 90s? Oh, I remember them. Crisscross will make you jump. All right, so check me. So there's some shoelaces what do you guys think good bad terrible amazing crap make <laughs> you want to jump jump there you go what are y'all making so random girl just said what are y'all making what's it look like what do you guys think what's it look like it how do i hold this thing i don't know i hope i hope it sort of looks like what it's supposed to look like i think it's pretty close anyway Amazing. All right, good, good. This is good. So it needs a Nike swoosh. I did not forget, Tyler. We will absolutely make a Nike swoosh. That's, ca that's happening for sure. Um, but I think this is pretty good, right? I mean, 
you know, you can always make improvements, but I think it's not bad. Uh, see, this is why you got to secure the laces, because one little thing I moved, I moved one little thing, and then the laces went all wacky. I, should, I just got to embrace glue. That's what I got to do. I got to embrace using glue. But there's that. So there's that. Let me see if I can change something here. All right, now, I think, what time is it? It's 10.30 on my time. <laughs> Jump around. Um... So I think I'm going to make a Nike swoosh, okay? I'm going to make a Nike swoosh. You guys like this is, you think this is a good one that I can present to the client? You think if I showed this to the client, you think she'd be kind of into it? I think she'd kind of like it. You glue. Yeah, you're not lying, Denise. I'm going to, there's going to be lots of you glue. I'm, I'm sure that the swoosh is going to go on you glue for sure. I was here in the beginning and I never thought it would look this good. All right, Tyler. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. All right, well, let me do this swoosh, all right? Since we're going to finish it, let's finish it. So I've been thinking about the swoosh all day, okay? I've been thinking about how to do it. So if I just, hang on, I'm running out of black. I got to restock my bag. Okay, so if I was to just make a swoosh like this, like bend it like that, it doesn't, for, for one, it doesn't look like the Nike swoosh because the swoosh is a little fatter down here and then it tapers off into a point, right? So I'm trying to figure out how I can get that shape with just these regular balloons. It's hard, okay? Now, I don't think anybody would fault me if I just like took you glue, if I took some glue and I stuck it here and I made it like this and I put it in like that. Look at that though, look at that though, guys. As soon as you put the swoosh on it, like, it completes the piece. It makes it so much better as soon as you put it on. Okay. All right. I'm happy. I'm happy. This is going to look good. But by the way, I don't like that. I don't like the particular look. So, I have an idea. Okay. Just roll with me. This might not work. These balloons, these black balloons I have are from 2017. So, they might, they might pop. <laughs> but here, I got an idea. Ooh. So when balloons start to, like when the rubber starts to break down and rot, they smell a certain way. And these black ones are pretty much tra they're trash. Let's hope they don't pop on me. All right, how big do I want this? So I need it. I'm going to, I am going to distort the balloon. For those of you guys who don't know about distortion, it's when you take an inflated balloon and you stuff it inside of an uninflated balloon. And then the uninflated balloon like shrink wraps around the inflated one and it gives you these like really interesting shapes. So I'm gonna do distortion. So I need to make it about that big. Okay. All right, now let's hope this works. I'm gonna put this aside for the time being. And this, I think what I'm gonna do is, so I'm gonna use a little nubby of a balloon and I'm gonna bend it in so let's see let's see if this works the way I want it to work so I squished it up so it's gonna stay hopefully like this I took a little extra piece right there and I I tied it in like that now first before I do this let's make sure I got it the right length uh, right there to there. Okay. Okay, actually, you know what? I want to make sure this, I got to let this go. I have to let this, this little twist go. Bowser be posted. Hey, I'm back. Bowser should be posted any second. That's cool, man. Um, so I got to let this go, but I don't want it to untwist. If I let this go, normally it would just come untwist, un untwisted. But I'm going to take this scrap scrap black piece and I'm gonna tie it up. So now if I let it go, it's still not gonna come undone. Okay, there we go, that little nubby. See, this is why dark blue or purple wouldn't have worked because you guys aren't seeing any of this or you can, but it doesn't look great. Um, what's up everybody? So I'm just saying hi to everybody in TikTok, saying hi to everybody in YouTube. Thanks for hanging out, man. I know this is kind of a while. How long we've been going? We've been going for two hours. So thank you very much for hanging out with me. 
I really do appreciate it. So now that I got this where I want it, I gotta make sure this is what the hell just happened. I'm gonna make this the right length. We'll make it right there, I guess. Okay. Okay. So hopefully this is gonna work. Okay. So here's the distortion part. I have to make this look like what I want it to look like, which is this, right? It looks like the swoosh, sort of, kind of, maybe just a little. And then I have to, while keeping that, that shape, I have to stuff it inside of this other balloon. Yeah, it's gonna be a difficult one, I know it. Yep, it's gonna be that kind of day. All right, hang on. Oh, whenever I hear the squeaks, whenever I hear the squeaks when I'm using black, I'm afraid it's gonna pop. Sorry, I'm looking down. I should be looking at you guys, right? I'm staring down. Huh. Okay, so the balloon's totally stuffed inside this other balloon. Now watch. Alright, let's see if it looks like the way I wanted it to look. <laughs> Not exactly a Nike swoosh, but hang on. Just trust me here. Roll with me. Alright, now this doesn't look exactly like what I want it to look like, but so I'm going to stick some more air inside of it and then reshape it how I want it to. I don't know if this is going to... Oh, I gotta get all the talcum powder off of this. It's crap. Okay. Okay, you ready? That's the balloons, it's not me, I promise. Oh it the balloon ripped on me. Yeah, I told you those 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 big black ones are old. Okay. Alright, let's try it. Hmm, wrong one. Hang on. Where'd I put them? We were almost there. We were almost there. The Nike sneaker looks awesome. Thank you very much, Janet. Thank you. All right, let's try this again. So this time, it's not going to pop this time. It's going to be fine. It's going to be totally fine this time. But it's all right if it pops. I don't even care because... I have a ton, a ton of those old black balloons from like 2017, and I don't use them that much. So, I, I don't mind if they pop. I need an excuse to use them. Sorry, I keep looking down again. I keep looking down. I'm not looking at you guys. I'm here hanging out with you, and you, and you, and you, and I got to look at you guys. Jeez. Okay. Fire some likes my way, people. Give me some likes. I'm working hard here. All right, ready? Okay, let's try this again. Hopefully it doesn't pop on me again. So again, doesn't looks more like a pipe than a, than a Nike swoosh. Let's see if I can fix it. I know. A lot of this, so when you're doing distortion stuff, it's, it's you do it by feel, because you can't see inside of the balloon. You have to feel what you think it's gonna feel, it's supposed to feel like. And then you work through from there. Hmm, hang on. Sorry guys, I need to inflate it again. Sometimes when you're doing distortion, you need to inflate it and then deflate it and then inflate it and deflate it over and over. Oh, it popped again, it popped again. This is starting to drive me nuts. All right, now I'm starting to get annoyed. Now I'm starting to get annoyed. For you guys, I'm starting to get annoyed for you. Because you're watching, and you want some results. You want results! And I'm getting stuck here with these crappy old balloons. <laughs> See, money kid, don't come for me, dude. I know, I'm, I know they're popping. Anyone have a few dollars so I can eat tonight? Hey, me too. I got a wife and kid that I got to support too. Anybody have a few dollars? No, I'm just kidding. I'm not kidding about the wife and kid. I do have a wife and kid. 
Okay. Okay. All right, let's go. Uh, sea <laughs> money kitty's coming for me. I popped too many balloons. I'm glad. I'm glad my address isn't out there. Okay. All right. Let's, let's try this yet again. Yet again. Because I'm sitting here trying to make it absolutely perfect, and the balloon's popping. So again, you guys are getting like a crash course in how to do this here. So again, I take this stuff and I smush it, smush it in. All right, I'm trying to look at you guys this time, okay? I'm trying not to look at nothing. So I'm literally shoving one balloon inside the other. So when you guys try this at home, don't use... What is it? <laughs> Don't use six-year-old balloons. They won't, they're not going to do well. Use new, fresh balloons. <laughs> Need my shirt. Okay, hang on. All right, here we go. All right, so I could just take this and make that the swoosh, but I don't like it. Let's try it this way. You saw my god! It popped again! It popped again! Oh my god, except the middle one popped. Oh my god, hang on you guys, hang on you guys. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I gotta bust open a brand new pack of balloons here. Oh my goodness, it's just... It's doing it to me. Okay. All right, let me talk to you guys. Not scared to make stuff with the balloons. I'm getting scared of one pop. Listen, I got over the whole popping thing with balloons in the first like few months. Because when you, when you first learn how to make balloons, when you first learn how to do it, you're gonna pop them all the time. Because it's just part of learning. So for all the, for all the young people, in, in, the, in the live here today, I'll tell you this. Balloons popping is part of the process. Failing is part of the process of getting better. So there's nothing wrong with screwing up and, and messing up what you're doing. Because when you fail, and anything, not balloons, anything. When you fail, you, you learn from your mistakes and then you get better for the next time around. So don't ever, for you guys watching, I don't know who needs to hear this. Don't ever be afraid of failure because fail, learning from failure is what makes you better. If you're too afraid to try something because you're afraid to fail, then you'll never get better. Failure is a great teacher. <coughs> okay, where's my shoe? I got to size it up real quick. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay, Tyron's like, okay. I didn't mean to sound preachy there, but it's, you know, anytime, I'm a dad, I'm a dad. Anytime I can sneak in a little bit of a lesson here or there, then I'm going to do it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. All right, what is this, the third or the fourth big balloon? If this one pops, I'm just ditching the black entirely and we're going to make it a different color. Because then I'll, I'll just buy a, I'll just take a color that I have that's newer. It might look weird and goofy, but I mean, we got an orange shoe anyway, so who cares, right? There's already a hole in it. Hey, can you guys hear it? Can you hear it? Yep. We're, we're ditching black. I'm getting another color. I'm getting another color totally. Not gray, I already have gray, hang on. Let's do something, let's do orange and green. Green, right? All right. It doesn't match, but I mean, who cares, right? The shoe's kind of busted as it is. I wonder what's gonna look like with the black and the green. It might look, might look good, might look crappy. Sonic is so ugly, what? I'm sure I read that out of context. Okay. 
Don't you get tired of blowing the balloons up and your fingers hurt? Sometimes. It, it depends. It depends on how long I've been. It depends on how long I've been doing balloons that day. Sometimes, yeah, like after a long day, my hands are just trashed. And sometimes uh, just from blowing up the balloons, my head is just killing me and I feel like I want to pass out. But for right now, I mean, we've been doing this for an hour and 25, or yeah, 125 minutes, two hours. So this is not too bad. And plus with all the talking I've been doing, no big deal. But if I'm under a time crunch and I'm just going, 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 then yeah. Joy Marks. And hey, what is that, Joy? I'm not sure what that is, Joy. Are you five bucks? Are you, are you giving me five bucks? Is that what that is? If that's what that is, I appreciate that. Thank you very much. That's so nice. If not, it's all good too. But if that's what that is, thank you. Mm. What is fi fish stick? What is that? Oh, there are oh, the fish. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Joy. Thank you. If that's what that is, thank you so much. Okay. So here we go. Ugh. All right, so you guys can even, can you guys see through it? Nah, you can't see through it. All right, there we go. Nope, I'm gonna bite it. All right, all right, all right, here we go. All right, sort of a Nike swoosh, it's a little fatter, so I could probably leave that actually. That's pretty, that's shaped pretty well. I might just leave that, what do you guys think? I mean, it's a balloon, right? It's not gonna be perfect. But that's not terrible. That's not actually, that actually is kind of a decent shape. What's the other guy? Who's the other guy in the account? He goes live too. So if you guys notice, our name is the balloon guys, plural. There's two of us, me, I'm Jason. And the other guy is Eric. Um, Eric and I are partners. We're, uh, we're business partners. We've been doing this balloon thing for a long time. Um, and we decided we wanted to make a cool channel where we can show off our balloon stuff. So yeah, it's Eric and it's me. We take turns doing our thing and sometimes we go live together too. But yeah, I think this is cool. Do you guys think this thing this will work? You think this will work? I think for all intents and purposes, this is cool. Do a Nike sign. Isn't this the Nike sign, people? Isn't this a Nike swoosh? I mean, I can't make it perfect. I mean, these aren't balloons, you know what I'm saying? So that's not mm. fish stick. No, you don't like it? Not good? Yes, it's cool. Yes, it's good. No, it's bad. Yes, it's good. All right. All right. I'm, you know what, guys? I'm leaving it. <laughs> good enough. That's right. Love being black. Good enough. That's right. Good enough for government work. All right, let's see. Right. Tie this off. <laughs> and that, that guy's like, it's good enough. Just keep moving. Just come on. Let's keep this going. Okay. So, oh, hang on. Forgot something. So this is, I think this is totally cheating, but I don't even care. I'm doing it. Wait, wait. Not the Nike sign. Fish stick, not the Nike sign. You don't like it? All right. Well, hang on. Here we go. So anyway, cool balloon you make. Thanks, Jose. So, um... Glue. These are called U glue dashes. For those of you balloon artists here who like to do stuff, U glue dashes save you so much time. So literally, they're just little squares. I'm gonna take two of them. One for each side of that Nike swoosh, and then we're gonna put it on here. Listen, guys, I'm not gonna do two shoes. Okay, I'm only gonna do one. I'm only gonna do it for this side here. So I'll put one right down here. And then I'll put two down here just to make sure it sticks. And then I didn't even walk away. Where did I put them? What, what's wrong with me? Oh, jeez. You ever, you ever like be in like mass chaos somewhere and then you like put something down? You don't even take two steps away and then you look around and you can't find it? That's what it's like when you make balloons because it's just a mess everywhere. All right, here, hang on. There we go. 
Got it. I got it. All right. I'm, I'm good. All right. So I didn't take the paper off, but that's where it is. And then this one, I guess I'll put right here. I didn't take the paper off of this one either. And then when you're ready to attach it or whatever, once you put it on the shoe, everybody will know what it is. Yeah, I think, I think, I, I think you're right. Yeah, so I think that'll sell it. So I take the paper off. Come on, damn it. Oh, darn it. I'm not supposed to be. Shouldn't be. I shouldn't be using swear words. All right. Because, you know, they're not nice. Okay, so that's all off. Can you show us your room, how it looks? <laughs> okay, hang on. I'll show you. So, shoe. I'm going to take this lace. I'm going to take this thing. Uh, but the thing is, with these U-glue dashes, once they're on, whew, they're hard to get off. So you got to be careful. So this isn't perfect. But uh, when I make it for real, I don't know, man. I think that looks kind of cool. I don't know. What do you guys think? Come on, let's see. What do you guys think? Not bad, right? The swoosh, I mean, it's not like a perfect point. It's not a, it doesn't come to a perfect point like that, like the, like the point does here, but I think it definitely reads like a Nike swoosh. What do you guys think? Bigger swoosh next time. Okay. I'll do that. I can get, I get that. Yeah, I get that. I get that. Like longer, bigger, or like fatter, bigger? What do you guys think? Dude, I want that so bad. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'm glad you guys dig it, man. So, okay. Question. Poll the audience. What should I... Is there anything I should do different next time? Like, I feel like the, uh, the, um, the sole, the white part of the sole, I think this is a little too small. Maybe I should use fatter balloons. This white part right down here. But I'm not really sure. What do you guys think here? Both longer and fatter. Oh, the, the swoosh? Okay. You should have done a black swoosh. Yeah, I know, I know, but you must have just come in. So I was wrestling with my balloons, and my black balloons kept popping over and over and over and over again. I'm just doing green because... That's what I had on hand that wasn't going to pop on me. But when I do the final product for the client, I'm definitely going to do it in black. I'm going to do it in red and black and gray and white. That's how it's going to be when it's done for real. This is just kind of a practice session. But I wanted to show it while I was practicing. I figure if I'm going to practice, I might as well practice, you know, so you guys can see it. You know what I mean? It makes it more fun. But yeah, yeah, I'll definitely make the swoosh bigger when I, when I do it for real. Because this is a little small. I agree. This is kind of this is kind of bowing down. I don't know if you guys see it. It's kind of bowing down a little bit. I'll fix that next time too. But I think this is decent. If the client doesn't like this, man, I don't know what I don't know what she's thinking. Man. So everybody, TikTok people, follow us. Follow our channel, the Balloon Guys, man. We make some cool stuff. Eric and I make cool stuff all the time. Uh, definitely hang out, like our videos, and all that happy stuff. That'd be cool. <clears throat> Welcome to the live chat. <laughs> yes, the sole should be thicker. Yeah, I think so too, Yasmin. I definitely do. And once I use it red, it'll be way better. I think I think the orange is terrible. I think the orange is... I, I mean, I had a lot of it. That's why I used it. But I think orange is a terrible color. The red will look really awesome. The red will look awesome. It pops though. Can I be a moderator? No, I'm, I'm not going to do moderating. I think I'm actually going to... I'm probably going to jump off in a minute because I'll make a short little video of this. I'll make a short video of this that I can put on the channel that I can just put on as a regular video. And then after that, I think I'm going to have to clean up this mess and um, get on out. Oh, somebody asked if they can see the room, right? Uh, <laughs> do you guys care enough? Do you want to see my, do you want to see this mess of a room here? It's like a, it's a tiny little bedroom, but it's, um, I got a whole bunch of stuff crammed in here. Can we see your messy room? Oh, man. All right. 
All right, so you got to forgive me. So, okay, guys, here's what I'm going to do. <laughs> no. Uh, my boy, and MP on, uh, tick, on YouTube said, uh, do you want to see the room? He's just like flat out, no, capital letters, no. <laughs> but it's all right. So after, I got two phones that I'm dealing with, one for TikTok and one for YouTube. And uh, I'm going to have to take them off the tripod and whatever, all that stuff. So what we'll do is I'll show you the room, but once I'm done, I'm just going to end the live because I'm not going to juggle the two phones and retape this phone up because this phone is literally taped up to my ring light. So I'll show you guys the room. I'll show you what a disaster area it is. And then I'm going to get out of here. Okay, guys, thank you so much. Before I pick up the phones, I'll show you, but thank you so much, everybody on TikTok for hanging out with me. Uh, anybody who gave me any gifts of roses or whatever, I didn't get a chance to see if you did, but if you did, thank you very much. It's always super appreciated. Uh, um, I think, uh, somebody in YouTube gave me a gift as well. Thank you very much. Immensely appreciated. Thank you. Uh, but regardless, thank you for just hanging out with me. Okay. I'm, I'm so glad you guys hung out with me. I love spending time with people who appreciate what I do. So, um, here, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to leave after I show you the room, but I'm going to, let me struggle with these things and I'm going to take the, the phones off the, the, the thing. Thanks for letting us tag along in the process. Hey, love being black. Th thank you for hanging. Like I said before, I'm, I appreciate that you appreciate it. You know what I mean? Okay, TikTok. All right, so there's that ring light. Hey, what, what's this? This is like looking into a mirror. What's this? What's going on? What's going on? There's YouTube. YouTube, TikTok, TikTok, YouTube. How you guys doing? Introduce yourselves. Yeah, it's good to see you. All right, cool. All right, hang on. Let me get this. Yeah, see, look, look at that. This, this, uh, let me show you all the, the painter's tape is the mess. That's how you guys got, that's how you guys stayed up on my uh, ring light without falling down. All right. Let me just uh, take, let me take my YouTubers off of the, off of the stand here. All right, guys. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's going on? TikTok, TikTok, YouTube. Now we're both off. Okay. So this is what you guys get to see, right? This is the set. That's it. I got some like lights around my door just to make it a little more interesting. This is a small room. So let me turn you around here. Don't look up my nostrils. I probably got bats in the cave. Okay, so my mess of a, here you go, I'm turning you guys around. My mess of a computer, all the stuff, printers. I don't know, I can't even see what I'm pointing at. Point, there you go, my wife's computers. Oh yeah, here, for those of you guys who are interested, let me spin this light around. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Okay. So there you go. This is my uh, organization system. So I have candy dishes full of colors. So many different colors you could possibly think of. Colors, 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 colors. Drawers full of colors. Those drawers are full of stuff. So all kinds of stuff all over the place. Um, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much, Um for that, for that gift. I appreciate that. But yeah, so there's inflators. There's an inflator. There's a pump that I kind of invented, not sort of, um, to, to make all this crazy stuff I do. Um, there's inflators. There's an ax. Don't ask why I have an ax in there. You know, home protection. You never know what's going to happen. Um, there's that. Guitar. More guitars. So there you go. I'm going to sit down, man. I'm tired. Hold up. Oh my gosh. So guys, thank you very much for hanging out. Thank you very much for hanging out. I really appreciate you guys' time. I know you guys could be doing a lot of stuff. You could be watching other channels. You could be watching t like legit TV or whatever. But you know, I'm just saying, I, I appreciate you hanging out with me. Thank you very much. Um, TikTok, I'll see you guys later. Um, YouTube, I'll see you guys later. Again, to everybody in both of the lives, to anybody who gave any gifts or whatever, joy. Um, thank you so much. I sincerely very much, <clears throat> I sincerely very much appreciate it. Thanks guys. Take it easy. Okay. Be good. And I'll see you next time. All right. If I can figure out how to end this. All right. For real. <laughs> All right. TikTok's gone. Now YouTube. Now it's on. We're going to do this now <laughs> for real. I got to go too. I'm <laughs> just kidding. Have a great night guys. All right. Next time. See you.